going to check on your tropical update. The National Hurricane Center about to put out some new information. So let's see what the very latest is here. We've been watching a wave moving across the Atlantic. It's been moving through the greater Antilles Islands. And at this point, yep, starting to make its way across Cuba. So it's got a high chance of development. But over the next seven days, right now it's moving over some pretty rocky terrain, literally the mountains of Hispaniola into Cuba, not helping this thing develop. But soon it'll be over the warm waters of the Florida Straits and expected to take a path somewhere close to Florida. Looks like the eastern Gulf of Mexico. So whenever anything's in the Gulf of Mexico, we, we definitely keep an eye on it. But at this point, it doesn't really look like a problem for us. However, because this has a high chance of development, could be our next tropical depression or perhaps even tropical storm. And the next name on the list is Debbie. So we'll keep an eye out for that. But again, not really an impact for us at this point, just something for us to keep an eye on. Now, what is going on in our local forecast is some warmth. Go ahead and look at the conditions in your neighborhood with a wide view. Not much for wind this morning, so it's allowing all that humidity to settle, and that's made for some visibility issues in the form of some haze and mist out there. Five miles visibility at CCIA, five miles in Beeville, and we're just a third of a mile for that visibility in Alice. So be careful if you're traveling along 281, Highway 40 four inland parts of 37 and 181 also likely to have some reduced visibility but it is a warm and muggy start for us out there inland locations in those upper 70s to the lower 80s along the coast and it's going to be a hot afternoon so what happens between now and then let's look to the dog walking forecast where our star dino has the right idea a nice big smile on this friday time to get out and enjoy the beautiful weather we're expecting we just have to be careful with some of that heat out there and it's going to warm up quickly this morning Check out your temperature situation, getting to those 90s by lunchtime, but it's already going to feel like the triple digits by then. This doesn't tell you the whole story because the humidity will play a very big role. But notice not a whole lot of wind for us today either. Southeast winds keeping it under 10 for the morning to pick up to around 10 during the afternoon. So not much help when our feels like temperatures are in the middle to upper 100s by 1 p.m. Heading into the heat of the afternoon. Uh, yeah, level playing fields with most, fo most folks near 110 for that feels like temperature. So we may see heat alerts this afternoon, but it looks like we'll stay under that threshold. But even tonight for your Friday night plans, feeling like the triple digits, please make sure you're staying hydrated out there. And if you're heading out to Art Walk, find yourself a nice cool beverage from any of the vendors that'll be out there because aside from that, the weather is going to be great. Lots of sunshine, 89 by 7 p.m., 85 by 9 p.m. And again, not much for wind, so wear your favorite hat too. Into the weekend, here's a look at your forecast. Not much for clouds on Saturday. Going to stay hot with temperatures in the 90s during the afternoon. Again, feeling like the triple digits. And because, yeah, we've got lots of sunshine out there, make sure you're wearing a wide brim hat. SPF 30 or better is going to help you out a lot. And uh, we continue this throughout the weekend. Your seven day forecast remains hot and humid. Take your pick for a high temperature 94, 95, 96. That's pretty much all we got and for morning lows. 76 or 77. Pretty plain Jane. Wash, rinse, repeat forecast. <laughs> I was like, I'll take 94. Uh, you know, yeah. always. Maybe 77 if you stay inside in the AC. I was going to say AC. <laughs> 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 All right, guys, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Have a fantastic weekend. Okay.